everybody welcome back to my youtube channel welcome to today's video so as you probably guess from the thumbnail and the title we're going to be doing a primark haul um for today's video so i really hope you enjoy i feel like i haven't been to primark in the longest time um i mainly went down just to get some underwear things like that for the kids to go back to school um but obviously i picked up some bargains and some little surprises along the way so if you want to see what i picked up in primark please keep watching Okay, just before we jump into the haul, I just wanted to apologise for any of my subscribers um, for the lack of videos. The summer holidays are literally kicking my butt and I'm just trying to like navigate my way through them and uh, filming and editing like that has just had to take a bit of a back seat um, because it's just little me that does everything and it's just a lot. Um, so yeah, if you are new here and this is the first video that you've clicked on, hi, welcome. My name is Emma. I've actually got three children. Um, obviously all three of them are home with me. It's just me obviously all day long because my husband is um, working. So yeah, I've been trying to vlog and do my usual content, but it's just been slow in getting it up on my YouTube channel. So apologies for that. Um, but don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. If you're not already, I'd really appreciate if you hit that subscribe button um, and join me here on YouTube and let's jump into the haul. Okay, surprisingly, I did pick up a few little bits for Christmas in here. Like I can't believe I'm saying the C word already but I feel like you have to be organized so um yeah can't wait to show you that but um my youngest birthday is coming up well actually my middle and youngest both their birthdays are in September they're actually a week apart didn't plan that too well but my youngest actually came um like six weeks early so she wasn't meant to be a September baby she meant to be an October baby but anyway so I got a few bits for her um which I'll show you the first thing um she's going to be two so I saw these pajamas now I love her in a like onesie the baby grows and you can still get those I think up to three to four um but I just saw these and they're like the flannel material and I thought they'd be really um like cozy and will keep her warm in the winter months I got age two to three they look pretty big um she's very tall but I think they're gonna be a bit big for now in the waist but I was planning on giving these to her for her birthday um the tickets are seven pound but they actually went through the till at four pounds so yeah i really love those and they're super snuggly and warm okay next up is another little white fit for um, my youngest she's kind of had a major growth spurt and she doesn't really have any leggings or anything that fit her because our weather is so temperamental um some days obviously she needs to wear warmer clothes so this is going to be mainly going into autumn and winter so again I did get this in two to three so it's a two-piece set so it's just this lovely um like sweatshirt sorry the handle stuck on my arm it's this lovely sweatshirt with this frill detail that goes just all down the front it actually goes um down the back as well and I love this kind of like lilac color and then you've got leggings that go with it with just a lovely floral detail on and that was at 10 pounds so I thought that was really good for a complete outfit Next up, there's a sweatshirt in here for my oldest daughter. So she's actually been wearing this. Um, it was six pounds, so I remembered to memorize the label before she took it out of the bag. So she's in need of just some like basic sweatshirts to wear because she likes wearing um, things that is with her jeans or her leggings. And they actually had quite a few, so I'm just unfolding all the cuffs. They actually had quite a few different colorways in this. So she just wanted this light gray, um, but they did also have like a lovely beige color. And this is so soft um, and six pound I thought was a bargain. I did see a couple in H&M because she can actually fit in the uh, women's section now. We were going to get this in um, extra small, but they didn't have any. So we went with a small one. It's not too big on her, to be honest. Um, but yeah, I'm going to pop back down and get her a couple more of these because they for £6, you can't go wrong. And she just needs a few more bits that will take her into um, autumn and winter. So yeah, I love that. I might actually get myself um, a couple of these because they are so soft. And that is the perfect thing to feel nice and cosy in on the autumn, winter mornings. Okay, and then I actually picked my son up a pair of just plain black joggers. These were £4. I thought that was an absolute bargain. Um, now, he's going to be 8 on his birthday, but I actually got him these in 9 to 10 because their sizes were 7 to 8 or 9 to 10. They didn't have any 8 to 9. I'm sure they do an 8 to 9, but they just didn't have any. But I thought when I looked at these and I held them against him, they actually are perfect in the length and they've got the drawstring waist. So, um, cause he's, quite, he's quite petite on his waist, but he's tall. Um, Penny is literally going to follow. She's like the same, exactly the same as um, my son. So yeah, I just thought those would be perfect for school, PE days, um, and £4 absolute bargain. They had these in 
so many colorways green blue um and gray I, they had in my primark okay now a couple of christmas presents coming up because these were so hard to find last year when it's probably my fault because i left it so late and then obviously with the um prices for the gas electric that sort of thing going up i think everyone kind of had the same idea um but my older two love a hot water bottle so do i so my mum actually bought me one of these style long ones for Christmas and my daughter um kind of just like mom can I buy a hot water bottle and I've never had it back so I thought I'm going to get them both these I saw them um they were actually down in the home section in my Primark so I picked up they were eight pounds yeah eight pounds each so I got this cream one for my daughter and it's so soft and um like snugly and I just thought it's the perfect length because you can really like cuddle into that in bed um, and then I got the grey one for my son. So yeah, that is gonna, well, these are gonna be put away for um, Christmas presents. I thought I'll get them while I see them. Um, and then, did we get two packs of these? Yeah. So every time I go down, I just like to stock up on the um, large oval cosmetic pads. So 90p, so just got two packs of those to pop in the bathrooms. And then my daughter wanted this, um, clip so this one was £2.50 this is one of the new in ones for the autumn winter range um it's actually got a lovely marble detail on it so it actually looks like it's going to grip hair really well um I do actually like the clips in Primark they hold up really really well I've got one in today I've got this is a two pack a couple of months ago now but I do just love um I'm doing a hair wash so it's perfect to just chuck it up and get out of the way and it just holds my hair is quite thick so it just holds it and it's not loose at all um so yeah she's picked that one up and then I picked up some shorts some pajama shorts um for myself because it is so hot in this bedroom um and I just wanted something even when we go into the the cooler months I remember when we were doing this last year and I brought the thermostat up and it was by far the hottest room in the house um so yeah I just thought I need some shorts um and I love I'm a bit of a sucker for a stripe so I love this light blue and white stripe I went with the size medium um just because they're not obviously to the point where they're going to fall down but I just prefer them to be looser on me rather than really tight and digging in especially if I'm sleeping it's just more comfy um and these were £3.50 um they did have different designs of the pajama shorts they had like lovely floral ones and they sort of also had like plain um like tank tops so like thin straps like this but just to pair with it in lots of different colours but I've actually got a few plain white pyjama tops that will go with this so yeah they had some really lovely pyjamas in there actually um and then I picked up this long sleeved top for my youngest how has it got that mixed up yeah this long sleeve top for my youngest I just got it in two to three I just thought it'd be perfect to just pair with some leggings um or a dungaree dress something like that and it was £2.50 again they had these in so many different colours um just on the stands where they're folded um, so yeah, really, really like that. And then she's actually going to be in need of some vests. So I did pick up a few packs for her while I was in there because it actually had her size. So I find it's a little bit of hit or miss as to um, if they've got a good variety of sizes in there. I think it depends on whether, obviously, they've had a delivery and how busy it's been. But they actually had all different um like strap ways so because i've picked these up to go into autumn and winter i've just got um two packs of the cap sleeves so not the thin straps like this cap sleeves and then i've got a pack of the longer sleeves so i went with two to three um so yeah like i said she's got two packs of these i'm trying to see if the prices on these i think they're £3.50 but it's been the price has been taken off of the back of these and i haven't got the receipt in here um no i think they're 330 actually and then this is the longer sleeve ones i always just go with plain white um i don't really like any color or patterns on her vests and yeah these ones were 330 so i thought that's perfect for her um and then i also picked up a couple of packs of the just cotton thongs so I have been trying for so long to get these. I like them in a size medium. They are a little bit big on me, but again, a little bit like with the pajama shorts, I don't like my underwear to cut in because I feel like um, it can like emphasize like my loose skin. So I just like it to sit nice on the skin without digging in. So I always go with the medium. Um, so I just got a pack of the black and then a pack of the white. These are my favorite ones to wear. They're three pound for five pairs. They wash really well and they're so comfortable. So yeah, I had to get some of those when I saw them. And then my daughter has picked up a pack. She had these in the summer actually. It's the um, 
press on nails so the false nails so these were in the clearance i think because they're making way for that autumn winter so these were in the clearance for a pound but she actually popped these on when we were on holiday and rose and they look really really cute so yeah and these ones seem to be the perfect size for her nails so they were actually in the beauty section like downstairs they weren't in the kids section but these ones fit her really well so yeah we got those and then last up, I picked up a candle for myself. So they have got some amazing homeware pieces in. I resisted the urge because I'm trying to be really good and mindful of buying things I don't need. And I have so much decor in terms of like pumpkins and things like that. So I'm going to get my husband to bring um, my autumn decor box home from our storage unit. So I'm going to want to put those out, I feel like, in the next couple of weeks. Um, but I just couldn't resist this candle. So this was £2.50, um, they did have bigger versions of this and they had ones that were actually in ceramic pumpkins that were beautiful, but I just thought, I don't mind spending £2.50 and it smells lovely. This one is um, in the scent pumpkin caramel latte and it's just a one wick candle, so yeah, I just love that. These colours are just everything, they're my favourite colours of the entire year, autumn, is my favorite season. I get so excited for summer, but really deep down inside, I'm such an autumn person and I'm not ashamed to admit, I have been on Google researching when I can get my pumpkin spice latte. So June the 29th, I find for Starbucks, I will be there ready when they open for my pumpkin spice latte. <laughs> So that is going to wrap up my Primark haul. I really hope you enjoyed watching. Um, it's not a huge haul, it just mainly went down because I haven't been for so long. I've actually had my eye on the um, beige trench coat. I think it's £35. They didn't have it in um, my Primark. They had the black one, but I really want like a beige one. Um, I know the colour is not ideal with three little ones, but yeah, I really want it. So I'm going to keep my eye out for that we've actually um got like a stock finder for in store um in the shop in bristol so i'm gonna keep my eye on that i don't know how accurate it is but um yeah it's not too much of a drive for me to pop down so yeah i really want to get my hands on that but let me know if you've been into primark recently i'd love to know what your favorite purchases are and like i said don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and if you're not already don't forget to hit that subscribe button as you're looking at the screen now, in the bottom left hand corner, you'll see my name, Emma Nightingale. If you just hover over that directly on this video, that's an easy way for you to just click subscribe if you've not already. But I'm going to leave it there and I will see you in my next video. Bye everyone. Mm -hmm.